All right, I'm here you're speaking with uh, Joseph Sicoli. He's with Mad Security and also works with the Hacker Academy. Yep. And uh, tell us a little bit about what Hacker Academy does, Joseph. Yeah, so we're here at DEF CON uh, with the Hacker Academy. The Hacker Academy is an online um, ethical hacking training platform where basically it was put together by a whole bunch of pen testers who really wanted something for people who are coming, you know, up and coming. And uh, we put together this series of courses where it's not just learning from instructors who are people who are out there doing Doing this stuff but also online hands-on training where you know we found that if you're not doing this stuff you're not going to be remembering it so we've gone ahead and we've developed a, a course that is designed around that idea um, we we start you at the very basics where it's not just you know here's networking and that sort of thing but also this idea of how do you you know, how do you look at problems differently? How do you get your hands around, like, when you get dropped into a big network? How do you break the, that process down? Um, and then we walk you through the steps of, like, here's doing hands-on of this or that, um, you know, where you're doing, you're actually doing cross-site scripting and that sort of thing. We're also in the process of revamping a lot of our content. We're developing a whole defender side of things where here's how to operate a security operations center. Here's, uh, you know, here's how to best utilize the tools in your environment. Um, so it's it's been growing a ton in the two years I've been here, and it just keeps getting better and better. Excellent. When was it established? Uh, Hacker Academy in its current form was established in 2010, and it I believe somebody's going to check me on those dates. But uh, yeah, Hacker Academy was established in 2010, and we've really been uh, rocking through some of our new content. Uh, we have a new content director who's uh, you know she's riding me for slides, so. And, and what about a uh, skill level for somebody who's interested in participating in, uh, in your trainings? Uh, skill level, so the beauty of it is, you if you have a higher skill level, you can skip over some of our lessons. Uh, if you have, you know, if this is just something that totally interests you and you just want to jump in, uh, it's perfect for that. Um, starting you at the very, very ground level. Okay, and so, uh, so let's say, uh, is this something for somebody who actually wants to pursue being a pen tester, or if somebody has a casual interest in understanding what pen testers do more? Uh, you know, it's definitely something, if, if pursuing penetration testing is something you're looking for, it's great for that. I know, because when I got hired on, they used that as my training, uh, as a pen tester. Um, but if you want it, like a casual thing, want to get familiar with certain tools or that sort of thing, it's really good for that as well. Okay, and uh, uh, so so give us a, a, a little breakdown of, of you know what does it mean to be a good penetration tester? Oh man, what a loaded question! It um, is a loaded question. You know, being a good pen tester, uh, the biggest thing is you have to kind of approach it as a science. Um, you know, as as you know, you have to go through and you have to be documenting, you have to be thorough, you need to be exhausting, you know, not just here's the, you know, here's the output of the tools, but also the analysis. That's what really um, separates the good and the bad pen testers. Also, one thing that um, I know I'm kind of proud of it because it's my modules, but um, like how to write a decent report, how to take the information that you have collected in your penetration test and actually make it something that the business can benefit from. Um, that's a really easy thing to overlook because people are often more focused on like the technical here's how here's the cool stuff I did but if you can't contextualize that for a business it's no good it's not worth anything and for a penetration tester uh, you're usually uh, unless it's with a very large organization you're usually an outside consultant coming in yeah uh, so uh, who would you usually be communicating uh, that that information the data that you get from the pen test to you have to communicate so that's the that's where writing a good report really comes in, is you need something that can start at the executive level, get them the information they need, the actionable stuff. Here's where you're good, here's where you're bad. Um, and then you need to be able to get all the way from that executive level, all the way down to the technical people who are going to be remediating the stuff that you found. Um, so, you know, we kind of define it as a little pyramid where at the top you have your executives, then you have your like CIO, CSO, so folks who are a little more technical, then you've got your managers, and then finally at the bottom you've got your, uh, you know, the technical people who are actually implementing this stuff. And so, uh, you know, of course it's easier to talk to the, the technical people, and the higher you up you go on the food chain, the more difficult it is to translate. Uh, Absolutely. What, what kind of advice can you give to people uh, who are trying to communicate to the executive level? Uh, you need, the first time you use a technical term, you've lost your execs. Every time. Um, these are people who you need to be able to, con to get the primary points across in a paragraph or less. Um, so that these po folks who are busy, who they really want to know, where am I good, where am I bad, and uh, 
you know, what steps do we need to take to move forward? Um, if you can get those points across quickly and without getting into technical jargon, you've totally nailed and you will, you know, you'll be back again. Excellent. And so uh, if somebody wants to get more information on Hacker Academy, uh, where do they go? They go to thehackeracademy.com or always like reach out to us on Twitter. We're at the Hacker or at Hacker Academy. Excellent. Okay. Joseph Socoli, thanks for taking the time out. Uh, Mad Security, Hacker Academy. Check them out. Absolutely. Have a good one.